fuck do y'all believe that women care about your feelings? Women don't care. Women don't care. I have consultations with men and men want to know why don't the woman care? Because you care. That's why. You care. Yeah, you care. So that means I don't have to care. That means you like me more than I like you. That means that it doesn't matter what I do, you still going to be there. It don't matter if I'm talking to another nigga. It don't matter if I'm lying. It doesn't matter if I'm cheating. It doesn't matter if I'm saying I'm going to be home and I'm not. It don't matter. You still care because you're wondering about it. And I tell niggas, don't book no consultation with me and you just trying to get back with the bitch. You wasting your goddamn money because I'm going to hurt your feelings. I'm going to hurt your feelings. I'm going to hurt your fucking feelings because you don't want to come to grips with a hoe. You don't want to come to grips that she lying. You don't want to come to grips that she don't like you like that. You don't want to come to grips that another nigga is waxing that ass. You don't want to come to grips with it. You know? You wasting your goddamn money if you don't want to know the truth. The truth of the matter is you care. And she doesn't. She ain't trying to listen to videos and trying to figure out what she did to you. She ain't trying to do that because she know you're going to be there. You're going to answer the phone call. You're going to answer the texts. You're going to want to go out with her. You're going to want to eat the pussy. You're going to want to fuck. You're going to want to be around her. You're going to be waiting for her. You know? And then that's a good one. When bitches, when niggas, when you hit your bitch up and be like, you know, I caught you lying. You lied. We don't care. We'll come up with another lie. No, that's not true. That That's not true. I'm I'm trying here. I promise you. All we got to do is promise you. All we got to do is be extra nice to you. Because we know for you to bring that shit up, you care. We know that. Ask any woman. You know, I found another nigga in the car. Another nigga nimble in the car. No, that was my co-worker. I gave her a ride and she had them in the car. We know you're going to believe that. For you to even bring that up. You should already know the answer to that shit. You give nobody the benefit of the doubt around you. Can't be tender dick. You know, y'all niggas tender dick around here. Believe in the bitch. We don't give a fuck. We don't care because you care. And you men love hard. And you men want a relationship. And you men want to be like, why y'all scared to be alone? Let's talk about that. Come on, good guys. Come on now. Why y'all scared to be alone? Niggas listening to this replay. Niggas in the clouds. Why you scared to be alone? Why? Why? Somebody reject you? Your mama wasn't there? Your father said you wasn't shit. Your dad didn't want to be in your life. Yo, you was raised by your grandmother. Why you don't want to be alone? Do you understand that I am a woman and I love being alone? Do you understand it? I love it. I love that shit. It be months and weeks I stay in my fucking house. I get everything delivered to me. I don't like to be fucking bothered. I'll block a bitch quick. Quick. I mean, sometimes I act like a nigga. I get cold as fuck. You know what I mean? I'm telling you already, the nigga I'm dealing with right now, he wants some pussy. And I'm like, I did live stream on this shit. And I'm like, listen, man, I don't want to fuck because you trying to get me emotionally caught the fuck up. You know, I got a business right now. I'm focused. Then the motherfucker. I got to be focused. But I'm listening to niggas want to be with bitches. And you got a bitch right here that don't want to be with nobody. Come on, now. That should tell you a lot. You should not want to be with no bitch right now. Especially if your ass is emotionally attached to a bitch. That means you kneel to her authority, man. Come on, now. Y'all niggas got to get it together. Y'all niggas care too goddamn much. Y'all care. Y'all just, you know, I want to. <laughs> I need a girlfriend right now. Dude, she wasn't full for me. Nigga, get out of that mindset. You emotional as fuck. You need to be slapped. You know, if I can do slap some of you niggas, whoop y'all asses back in shape. Y'all was my damn son. I'll whoop your ass. i get a belt and I will literally whoop your ass. I tell you to wake the fuck up. What the hell are you doing? A lot of you niggas tucking your dick between your legs for a bitch. 
crying over a bitch that's sucking another nigga dick. She's sucking another nigga dick, fam. And you want her. Why the fuck? What's wrong with y'all niggas? Man, I can't do this shit, man. A lot of y'all got to break y'all own heart. Break your fucking heart, nigga. Anything that will hurt you when it comes to the bitch that you in love with and fucking imagine that shit in your head. Break your own goddamn heart. Come on, now. A lot of y'all niggas out here looking for emotional support. Y'all around here paying bitches. I would get a belt and spank you niggas. You, you, you wrong on so many levels. And you want me to tell you what you want to hear, nigga? I'm not about to stroke your goddamn ego. I'm not doing that. I'm going to tell you some real shit so you can wake up. Your ass in the goddamn car, texting the bitch. Every nigga, any man that hit me up about a bitch, the first thing I tell him to do is block the bitch. Block on everything. Block that bitch. And when you come back to me, I want to know what have you done. Because we go through different things. I want to hear that. I don't want to hear the bitch. Fuck the bitch. Because if she wanted you, she would be chasing you. Listen, we women, we'll kneel to a nigga authority once you get us wide open. You know what I mean? We'll be calling you, babe. Please, I'm sorry. You know where you at, baby? I miss you. I'm sorry. I fucked up. Even when we were, even when we wasn't wrong. We wasn't wrong. You were wrong, but I'm still begging. That's what we do. But y'all got bitches. The bitch done fucked up, and you still trying to make it work. Come on, now, niggas. Y'all niggas got to get better than this. Like, that shit is pathetic. Now, that's pathetic. That's some pathetic shit. You got a lot of explaining to do. A lot. You got a lot of explaining to do. The bitch don't want you. You can't compensate for nothing. She ain't going to like you. And you got... Niggas around here blaming the bitch. Why are you blaming the bitch? Good, that shit fall on you. That fall on you. That's your castle. This is your kingdom. This is your home, your car. If you ain't focused on your money, why are you focused on the bitch? If you don't got over twenty thousand dollars in your savings account, why are you chasing hoes? The purpose. What is the purpose here? What's the goal here? Come on, I. You know, this shit, like, don't make no sense. And on some real shit, if a person cared about you, they'll tell you this shit. Because a lot of y'all delusional. You're fucking delusional. The next one. You question yourself for a woman. Every man... That we I talk to you question your your abilities as a man for the woman that you're dealing with. Why? So y'all so niggas question themselves now. Why are you doing that? You know why you doing that? Because you insecure. You insecure. You think you doing something wrong. If if you ain't lying, if you ain't playing games and you being real with a bitch and you know you are. Why the hell are you questioning yourself? You know you ain't lying. You know you being real. You know you at work. You know you grinding. You know you taking care of your business. Why are you questioning yourself still with this bitch? You question yourself. A lot of y'all questioning yourself. Is this right? Is that right? Only you know that shit. I'm there with you. You know the vibes. When she said she was going to come to your house. And when y'all say y'all was going to meet up. If she said she was going to sleep. If she said she was doing this shit, whatever the fuck she said, and she ain't do it, you right. Stop going back to you. Y'all go back to you. You think if I'm fucking with a nigga, like the nigga not questioning my damn self, like am I able to be the woman for the job? I'm going to question China. Why would I do that? I'm not questioning my goddamn self. You got a woman here ain't questioning herself, but you niggas, y'all questioning yourself for a bitch. Come on, huh? Peep game. Putting you up on game. How a motherfucker will have you drop your standards and your guards for them. A lot of y'all do that. That's game. Peep game. That's how motherfuckers finesse you. That's how y'all get finesse. That's like that's like somebody telling you, trust me.
trust me, but I, um, trust me and let me have my way with you. But I don't trust you because I need to have my way with you. That's what women do to you and you fall for it. So yeah, trust me. I'm home. I'm not cheating on you. I'm not lying to you, but I don't trust you. You a liar. You must prove yourself for me. So women are now in the role with you niggas. That's what they doing. They switching the role with you niggas. And you niggas are falling for it. That's, that's just straight up game. And y'all niggas fall for it. Let me tell y'all why y'all fall for it. Because y'all feel like because she's a woman, she got a hole between her legs. That And a lot of that content around here make it seem like women are dumb. Women are stupid. Women are dumb. That's what a lot of y'all niggas fall short at. You don't believe that shit? Bitch have the potential to blow your fucking brains out. Why the fuck y'all listening to that shit? It's because the bitches he deal with, they were dumb. Not the bitches you. You probably deal with a bitch that's been finessing niggas all whole goddamn life. You put nothing across nobody. Nobody gets that that access to you. Everybody must prove themselves. Everybody. So why y'all letting these bitches gas y'all up to believe that they're and you're not? You must prove yourself to me because i'm the woman here and you're the man my last man cheated my last man lied my last man told me anything my last man took advantage of me so you must prove yourself so you gotta compensate for the nigga that fucked her and left her come on I, y'all niggas working for the other man you know what i mean last man pumped and dumped a shout out to ramil last man pumped and dumped her now your ass coming to the picture now you gotta prove to her that you ain't gonna just pump Dump her. You're going to be the man for the job. Come on, I right? And bitches finessing y'all like a motherfucker. Just saying. So, you question your abilities as a man. So, you got a woman telling you that you can't do this and you can't do that. And I must see this in you and I must see that in you. But she ain't proving nothing to you. And then you begin to question yourself because she's responding in a way you don't want her to respond in. But if you was the puppet master putting feelings inside of her, you already understand that certain things she must do to get inside your life. Because you're the puppet master, she's not. But because she's the puppet master, she's inciting feelings inside of you. And then you begin to work for the bitch. You begin to work for her. You working for her. You doing what she says. You running the hoops and you tired, nigga. A lot of y'all niggas tired. You're tired. You questioning yourself. You know, damn, I can't do nothing right. Damn, I ain't, I ain't choose the right restaurant. Man, they ain't buy her that outfit she wanted. Man, they ain't get that food she wanted. Man, she in her feelings now. I ain't getting no pussy now. Come on, huh? Stop questioning yourself for a bitch. I'm not doing that for nobody. I'm at a stage in my life. I do that for nobody. Now, I'm a crib tonight. That's a whole nother story. Nigga be having me weak as shit. The next one. 